Hi, Mr. Muggins. Uh, if this is about the rent. Mr. Parker, this call serves as your third and final one. Eviction proceedings. Wait, wait, I, I get paid at the end of the week. I get... Ugh. Eviction proceedings will start Friday unless full payment is received by close of business. Good day. Yeah, good day. Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Trophy at the Babbling Belgian, and welcome back to Marvel Spider Man, where we're in front of the Lincoln Center, where we just got a uh, very bad call because we, uh, we're gonna get evicted from our apartment. So I, I'm feeling like we won't be able to access that apartment anytime soon. But Shocker has been reported to be on the loose, and therefore we need to get swinging. Swinging! There we go. Getting close to uh, Shocker's apparent location. So uh, he's supposedly already breaking in somewhere again, right after he got out of prison. Ooh, this looks bad. So, Shocker, a more equipment based supervillain. Hi, Herman. Seriously? Okay. So we need to get into a high-speed chase. Oh, that was stupid. What's the money for, Herman? Why do you care? Actually, I don't. Just trying to make for light conversation. I'm done talking. How does he even hear you? Much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Okay. That seems a bit uh, rough around the edges there. At least talk to me so we can make it interesting. Herman. There we go. Got gotcha. Get him. Now let's talk. Come on, Spidey. You got off guard there. Smack. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. This is getting really hairy. He's going along a really weird route for some reason. Okay. Move, move, move! What am I even watching? Oh, I'm apparently dodging that. There we go. Just need to be really careful because apparently he's now actually just throwing projectiles in my face. There we go. Take down. He's gonna fire that, isn't he? Yep. There we go. The suit is really cool, though. Looks like an evil Iron Man. Can we talk design details? There we go. Maybe later. Okay. That was really underwhelming. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Okay. A shocking comeback, but yeah, that was really, really stupid like comeback. I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. And uh, level up. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ, you're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah, whenever, whatever. Okay. Thanks, MJ. So I'm I just gonna... We're talking again. Cool. Yes, we are. So we're gonna talk to Mart Lee because he has an art history degree. That's convenient. But first, let's go into the skills menu. 
I also unlocked a new suit I could unlock. The Secret War Suit. This charges amplified EMP build up to stun enemies and disable their weapons. Cool, but not something I can afford right now. Ah, this one is really, really interesting. Hazard Zone. Web Throne knocks enemies down during the windup, clearing the immediate area. Because I've not been using that uh, Web throw to throw objects in everybody's faces because you're so vulnerable during the windup. But this should actually fix that up. Great. Now, let's get into the Feast Center. There we go. Uh, maybe, maybe I should. Yeah. Because I'm still in Spider Man mode. Mr. Lee will be here soon. I could use a snack. I could use a snack. Ah, uh, since you can eat at the feast center, although that doesn't seem like it's coming from the feast center. Did you just buy a donut as Spider-Man? Where do you keep your wallet? Or phone for that matter. Welcome to feast. Uh, and he's got a change of clothes already as well. Mr. Lee's usually in his office now. Okay. Let's take a look at, uh, at the office. Seems like the office is upstairs. Peter, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Am I going the wrong way again? Oh, there's stairs over here as well. Um, hmm. Doesn't seem like there's any doors here. Well, there should be... There's clearly an area over there, but apparently <laughs> there's no way to access that room. Okay, going back down. I'm supposing, yeah, he's not in the, the laundry those. machines. Wait a second, he is upstairs. I'm an idiot, you know that? I'm assuming if you've watched a few of my videos, you know that already. But, director, he does have a fancy office for something so charitable. Let's get in. Hello, Martin. How are you? Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. <laughs> See what you have. Burn. To all art students in the country. Interesting. In the world. Where did she find it? I'm really not sure. Why? What is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. Did this you? Here roughly translates to demon. Demon? He's, my father he's looking a bit weird. With that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. That's awfully specific. So, Peter, listen. even if you didn't have an art degree, you would that have known what is, that was. It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. Sounds like you do know. Why take the risk? Hmm. This feels suspicious. Does the nice smart Lee have something to do with the demons? This is gonna be sad if that's the case. Okay, can't run for it at the moment. Ah, hey. phone call. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. No, I'm with MG on this Demons, one. Huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Okay. Well, there we go. That went about as well as I could have hoped. He looks horrible outside of cutscenes, by the way. Uh, but I do love the little details in the environment. I mean, even the carpet has this little wrinkle in it. Because, yeah, carpets never stay properly on the floor usually so that's nice although of course if you start noticing that there's wrinkles everywhere but uh let's get outside again unless we need to talk to somebody no we talked to the chess game already hey kid how's all the science stuff the science stuff is going great we made a spider suit oh don't tell him that there we go i'm back in the spider suit here we go and who do we need to call now? The mask complete. Does that give us another level? It does. Me at the lab. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. Okay, fair enough. First, let's check out the, our skills and our melee damage has increased by 10%. There we go. 
Ooh, whole triangle to yank small arms like pistols and batons right out of enemies' hands. That sounds like something I want to be able to do. So holding triangle to do that. New side mission unlocked. I'm gonna check out the map. Give me a second. Oh, hey, Aunt May. Mr. Lee spoke to me. He seemed worried. Are you into something dangerous? Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry. I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. No, we're not. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. I'm just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I think you remind him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration's mutual. You've got a good boss, May. I'll tell him you said so. Love you, Peter. Okay, goodbye, I'll make. There's a freaking Avengers Tower in here as well. Never noticed that, but there it is. So let's uh, descramble this tower, and uh, that should allow us to get the, um, the side activity available for us. There we go. The green Greenwich District Tower activated, and that gives us a few landmarks, backpacks, and yeah, burglaries to solve. Attention unit, drug deal report. Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I didn't forget, forget, I just, I, I'll be there soon. <sighs> this tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Come on, Parker, you're better than this. Okay, so we're late again for something. How did I lose track of time? We barely did anything. I mean, I wanted to do the side quest first, but... Backpack token. There we go. Another backpack token while we're at it. But, uh, yeah. All Receiving reports of hmm. robbery. Let's get back to the lab then, because we don't want to... Yeah, anger Dr. Octavius. We know what he's capable of if, he, if we get him angry. There we go. Right back at the lab. Pretty much landed right in front of the door. I'm getting the hang of the swing. There we go. I'm back in Peter Parker's lab coat this time. And let's see. So there's a lieutenant ready for his fitting. That sounds like something that could go wrong. Horribly. Let's see what happens. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do and... Okay. Oh, crap. Yes. <laughs> Seems to work nicely. Hey. Hey. What do you think you're doing? This site's been declared a safety hazard. By the city? Stop that right now. This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter yeah, Parker. This doesn't work How out. The oh. How hell are you? Speak of the devil. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> That's it's a Norman. Norman. Norman, what a are you familiar doing? Familiar face. The As in a familiar actor, actor actually. Strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <sighs> Those were excused by me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But, but I've had a breakthrough. Yeah, that's the point, probably. Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? Nope, it isn't. I'm trying to help you, Otto. You're free to continue your work. So the boss of a major corporation is also the mayor of the city. At Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talked about. This oh, he has a very angry lady next to him. Knocking. <laughs> yeah, just in case you were wondering, Norman Osborne is a very bad guy. Easy, easy, easy. Yeah, he just lost everything. They didn't take everything, 
maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. Oh. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. Hmm, that sounds like a villain in the making. I mean, you gotta give Insomniac props for just playing around with uh, the story a bit. Because we know a lot of these characters and we expect certain things from them. I wish but could do something to help Doc. They really made Dr. Octavius Harry. seem like a very, very nice guy. Dad. No. Norman never listens to Harry. He even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. Should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. Okay. So Harry Osborn is a friend of Spider-Man. Hmm. Might as well do that then first. And now for listener email. May from Queens writes, You're so full of anger and I wish you could get help managing oh, your Car chase. Sorry, J. Jonah Jameson. I'm gonna cut you off there. There we go, car. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's just rude. Oh, there we go. Oh, this is cool. Uh, do I need to... There we go. Kick that guy out of the car. And then... Uh, and the driver. There we go. Let's pull him out. Oh, we need to stop the car, of course. Ow. He even took damage from that. That concludes our Spider-Man car tour of New York. Stop the car without taking damage. Force the car to stop safely. We apparently didn't do that. Did we kill someone? Jerk. Sorry. There we go. De scrambled one of the towers in Hell's Kitchen. So uh, Daredevil's turf. And uh, that should unlock a whole batch of new stuff. Ooh, a lot of bat bags apparently. Not bat bags, backpacks. And of course, the lab that we need to visit. Um, do we do that first? Hmm. You know what? I'm, s I'm just going to check out the side mission first. Give me a second. So there we go. Our first You're side quest. I need help. Okay, you need help. Hello. Spider-Man PI. Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, I'm not the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Okay, so now we're helping with relationship detox issues. not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Let's see if we can. So, uh, give me a second to just... Head over there. Might just be because he's at the detox center, so it might just be that he's helping out a, a recovering drug addict. So why not tell his wife about that? Uh, redirects. That seems like something that's in the middle of the road for some reason. Show us your face already. That's Rodrigo. He's really nervous. He's a security guard. Woman doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? You that angle. I need to get it straight on. Over. Okay. The plans, it won't. Gotcha. There you go. Looks good. Remember, tell Tessa. About this, and I leak the photo. So he's being blackmailed, clearly. And now we need to follow her. Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo of you. Does this woman look familiar? When did you exchange no, contact information her. with her? What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. This is a fast taxi, by the way. He's hauling ass. Where the hell? So yeah, he's working at a casino, so the obvious 
explanation here is that he's uh, being blackmailed to the let them steal from the casino. No purchase with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the high line. Okay, yeah. Can do that. Just crawl around, equip the camera, and just take a picture. Rigo always was a sucker. The boss will be at. Let's see the plans. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, turns around on a spider web. Gotta catch my train. Don't want to keep the boss waiting. Now it's gonna be our biggest score yet. Hell yeah. How many people are in on this? I've gotta follow him. Okay, if you say so. Oh, he's going on the ground. Why is he getting off? Uh, tapping into the train system should help me follow the train's path. Oh, I could just go... No? Oh, gold. Oh, yeah, that's an interesting view. Carmen, the blackmailer met some guy under the high line. Sounded like you knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. He went to prison years ago on a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, they'll need at least a wheelman and a safe cracker. Well, this is cool. Things. Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out. This is, is annoying. This an express line? Can't let that train out of my sight. End of the line. I should head over near the subway exit and wait for him to get out. Okay, sounds like a plan, Peter. I haven't had combat this entire time, by the way. I'm really getting rusty. For that office building. Okay. How can I follow him while he's inside? Because I don't think... Oh, he's in the elevator. This looks, this looks funny. Da -dee 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 -dee. Okay. So he's passing by the door. Should probably not be on the window. I got the plans, boss. Good. Review the schedule of the monitor. I put out hires on the whiteboard. Mark their positions on the map. Oh wait, the map. Practically a kid. My brother's kid. We can't trust him. Anyway, it's done. He's already picking up our sick. There we go. Casino heist. Roman's ready and we are running late. Let's roll. They're on the move. So that's enough evidence-wise, I suppose. But now we need to follow that I car. I now I just have to stop that car. Stop. That car. There we go. And on top of the car. And there goes one of them. And then the guy on the right. Taken out. And then the guy on the left. And stop it! And now we need to stop that other car. How the hell is he even hitting me? That guy is, is freaking dead shot. There we go, on top of the car. Punch the right guy. Punch the left guy. Is there one in the front as well? No, doesn't seem like it, so that's the driver. Ooh! Jesus! Spider-Man! Holy crap! Oh, Yeah. So that's why I took damage. I need to... Oh. There's a lamppost right through the car. I love taken it care of. Plan falls apart. Yeah, that hey, wasn't Carmen, great. Your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City cancelled. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night Deshaun committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friend. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo. Especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will. Or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. Thanks, Spider-Man. You're welcome, Carmen. There we go. Spider-Man PI completed. And we got a bunch of experience for that as well.
And now we got a loading screen that got us back into daytime apparently. But I'm gonna take a little break. So thank you guys enormously for watching. I hope to see you guys in the next episode where we'll continue on with the main quest. So we're gonna visit Harry Osborne's lab to see if we can't find anything over there. So thank you guys enormously for watching and see you guys in the next episode of Marvel Spider-Man. Goodbye.